Nicolas Sarkozy faces a huge task as he takes to the stage in Nice. He needs to re-energize his bid for re-election at this late stage of the campaign. And he surrounded himself by his most ardent supporters. Yes, I am proud of the French identity, the French language, French culture and the French nation. This doesn't contradict the idea of Europe. Europe is built on individual nations. It's these free and sovereign nations who freely decide to link their individual destinies with a common ambition. Nicolas Sarkozy is trailing as he goes into the first round of voting on Sunday. Now, the candidate who comes out on top in the first round won't necessarily go on to win the election. But nevertheless, winning in this first round does give the candidate a huge psychological advantage, which can propel them all the way to the final day of voting on May the 6th, and they hope to victory. While Sarkozy was on the French Riviera, François Hollande chose the gritty backdrop of an industrial region for his final day of campaigning, a way of underlining his promises on jobs and the economy. He's the front runner, but he's not taking anything for granted. I'm fighting against the idea that the result is known, even before French people have gone to vote. Nothing is won in advance. It's not over. We're going to need a lot of modesty in this campaign and a lot of perseverance at the same time. And that's what I've shown with my proposals. Hollande's greatest challenge is to convince voters that he has what it takes to be a president. Sarkozy's problem is that many people dislike him intensely and both men will be trying to win over the undecided and the apathetic. He screwed up his presidency. He didn't do what he had to do. The policies he's proposing now, why didn't he suggest them before? I hope that the French will vote in great numbers. I have heard many people say that they won't, because they don't want Sarkozy or Hollande as their president. The campaign is now, to all intents and purposes, over. The French have 24 hours to contemplate the candidates and their programmes. And Sarkozy will be hoping there is still time for the tide to turn. Jackie Rowland, Al Jazeera, Nice in southern France.